My name is Esteban. Welcome to Flex5101. Today I want to help you guys set up your template for the initial SketchUp. We're, we're working with 2018 today. Works the same with any version, whether it's older or, or new. What we want to do is go ahead and basically go under the Window tab, go under Preferences, and look for the template. We'll click on that, and then we'll go ahead and make sure that we've highlighted and selected the Woodworking in Inches. This is the one that we use in-house and it works very well with all the structures that we tend to work with. So we'll hit OK. Next thing we want to do is that we want to change the perspective of the camera. So we'll go under the camera tab. We'll look and scroll down toward the perspective and then we'll switch that to the parallel projection. And we'll see right away that we've changed it and we've kind of squared it up a little bit more. And it's just a little bit easier for the eyes. And then the last thing that we want to do is go under the tab view click on the toolbars and here we're going to want to make sure that you guys have selected a certain uh, certain tools to help you with your drawings and if we look here we want to make sure that we have if you haven't already installed the flex5 creator go ahead and get online and basically download the flex5 creator so we want to make sure that that one is clicked in the next thing we want to make sure that you have is the large tool set. So I'll just go ahead and unclick and I'll click it back just to see what it is that we're looking at. And we see that it's on the left hand side. So this is basically your all around, all the tools that you need. So it's very uh, easy and very important to have there. The next thing we want to make sure we have is the measurements. So again, I'm just clicking and unclicking and clicking back just to see where it's coming up. And here we see it at the bottom left corner of the screen and this is the measurements tools for any time you need to input dimensions this is where you're going to see the input next thing we want to make sure we have is the standard tools and then once again we click it back and we're going to see that they are on the top left corner of the of the screen after that we're going to go ahead and do the styles Styles is going to be right on the top. You can arrange these any way you want. It's just that we want to make sure that we have all these selected. The styles here are the different uh, x-rays and different views, see-through views of the uh, drawing and the structure. The next thing we have is the views, which is the uh, houses on the top part of the toolbar and then this is going to be for the camera views basically top view side view right view back view etc also one last thing that we want to make sure we click and we have highlighted is the dynamic components and this is something that we're going to go ahead and add to our screen and that's going to be it the dynamic components is going to help you with all the decking surfaces any kind of surface that you're going to be drag and dropping or incorporating into your drawing this is going to be where you're going to see the information for the dynamic components all right so that's the basic setup for the initial sketchup opening you can arrange them any which way you want uh, and that's going to be it for today guys okay take care